It's colorful and cheery. It's been spotted all over town. Maybe you've seen it. We are talking about a van that's now been vandalized two nights in a row. News 4's Carly Gordon spoke to the owner. She's live in West Nashville where those vandals left something behind. Right, Carly? Yes, Tom, see all of this white paint poured out all over the street? This was left behind by vandals, and now the residents here want answers. Every morning, Marie Gonzalez and her dog, Lakota, can't help but notice the funky van. I like it, anything eclectic. So when they saw raw eggs the first day, followed by white paint the next, Gonzalez reported the vandalism on the app next door. I don't want anybody to have their stuff damaged, and if they get comfortable with that, they might go elsewhere. The van belongs to Meredith Wilson. It's been everywhere from New Mexico to Belmont. Wilson painted it with her family, hoping to spark joy and conversation. A good way to meet new people. Um, and yeah, just like a way to bring people together. Wilson used to park the van outside for all to see. Now it's hidden away in her garage. It does disrupt the peace and kind of make everyone in the community, like in this area, just a little bit on alert. As for a possible motive, some were buzzing online about it being parked in the street, saying the van posed a risk to drivers passing through. We were just waiting for it to get hit. Still neighbors say that's no reason for vandalism. Regardless of the message, it was somebody put some time into it. Um, and that sucks that someone did that. Now, Wilson did fill out a police report. However, her hunch is that a kid was responsible. Wilson works with children, and she says if that is, in fact, the case, she doesn't want to prosecute. She just wants those kids to get help. Tom?